Hey guys, Randy here with an all new Geek World Order video and just enjoying a day off from work. Hitting up some stores. I got a few errands to run today, so thought I'd hit up some Targets, Walmarts, things like that. Trying to see if anything's new, so I think, um, all right, that's the layout aisle. I think the, this one has a better aisle next door, so let me uh, take a look here. All right, so transformer section. Not super great with the selection, but the Legacy Beast Wars Transmetal 2 Megatron. So I was looking for that. For all a decent amount of classified figures. And though we do have more of the Dicelings. So the Dungeon Dragon, which I actually just put up the video for the, the Rakor, which is that guy back there. I got that one. So I'm definitely gonna pick these ones up. The owl bear was on my list, so that's grabbing that one. I'll have to look for the other ones, but the owl bear was actually on my list today. Yep, so Target still have this up on display. That is totally stripper pole Mario. There is no other way to describe this man. So apparently, you know, saving the Mushroom Kingdom apparently does not pay all that well because Ma Mario's got to work the pole to get some more money, apparently. He, he's got, he needs coin, and he's got a mushroom addiction, so, uh, poor Mario. All right, let's check this wall of collectibles. This is sometimes a hit or miss area. Well, that's actually cool, a green arrow figure for DC, but don't really need that. Pops. Well, that's a cool Wolverine pop. Got Shuri. Doing some cool things with the pops, but I'm just like not needing them. Oh, classic Star Trek. Okay, so that's the phaser. That's a maybe. Interesting. Reaction figures. More Star Trek. Okay, there's the Playmates um, Discovery. I'm probably gonna pass on those because not really a fan of Discovery. Oh, more, more of the, more of the Star Trek stuff. I might need that Enterprise, but I'm trying not to go. Cr I don't want to go crazy with that line. Pops or pop selection is not looking so great right now. Yeah, pop selection not great. Some of the more higher that's a that's a cool batman thing oh apparently it's got some all right there is um... okay oh, i thought i was gonna do some sat some sounds or something all right it just lights up it's actually a cool uh war Greymont figure but overall, it's what we're looking at here. So not terrible for a lot of the selection, but nothing that I particularly need today. All right, so I'm gonna try something a little bit different here. I don't even know the car is gonna let me do this, but <clears throat> so far it hasn't shut off. So uh, one thing I did was I got a actually got a dash mount so far that works for this car. It's one of those uh, air vent clips. Okay, let's try that again. I don't know why that did that. So, let's see if it actually does anything or allows me to do this. Like I said, I got a a dash mount for the phone. So, hopefully I can do more of these kind of videos. That'd be cool. I mean, so far...
car it hasn't shut itself off, so we're good there, but there's probably going to be a whole lot of noise from my air conditioning, I just realized that. Yeah, that's not... Maybe not going to be the best option of anything we have, but... This is just a trial run. Like, I'm literally just driving across the street to Walmart. But I thought maybe we could try some of these if this works. Maybe I could do some more vlogs where I just talk about random things on my way to work. Uh, don't mind me, gotta pay attention to the road here. But so far the thing hasn't shut itself off. I'm trying to figure out how much AC I can use because I just realized that's probably going to be a source of noise, but we'll see. I know I'm just rambling, but I'm going to Walmart because I want to find more figures. Uh, this particular Walmart, it's the Vieira Walmart in like the northmost end of Melbourne, Florida. Stay in your lane, buddy. So, I'm just testing things out. Like I said, this is me just kind of free balling, spitting some ideas. And I would like to make these vlogs a little more interesting. Or find other ways to have more regular content available on the site, on YouTube. So, hopefully this is not like one of those things where it takes like too much out of it. And, yeah. But yeah, we get to take like a, a little two minute drive here. But, almost at Walmart. So, right, I'm in the parking lot, I'm gonna pull in. But, to be fair, this was more kind of a test to see if I could just do like the try videos. <clears throat> oh, excuse me, in the car. Which I think this clip is gonna let me do it, so. I have to sit down in the seat a little bit. But overall, I think we're good here. Alright, so I'm going to go into Walmart and look for some more, look at more action figures. And I actually do have to, like, get some groceries here, so. Alright, so I'm going to head inside now. Alright, so Transformer-wise, not doing so great here. Um, they got more of the Earthspark stuff, but... I don't really need that particular line. Unfortunately, not great selection for Legacy. I don't know what these are. Collectible designer. So like, it's kind of a plush thing. Got a Bumblebee, a Megatron, an Optimus. Okay. Oh, the Transformers, the movie, repaint Starscream. I'm... More than likely going to pick this up, but not today. But that is the G1 Starscream in a very much more cartoon accurate paint job. So, selection is not great today. At least Transformers wise. Let's see if the rest of the aisles got something better. Wait a minute. Construction simulator? This? Okay, that actually sounds kind of interesting. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Alright, figure I'd do at least a sweep of like the more pop culture section. But before I de officially declare this Walmart a bus today. But not a lot going on here. Some of the higher end figures, these different other collectibles. Although the Spike Spiegel actually looks like an interesting figure. Um, I'm really not trying to start like new collections. So I don't really have a place to display it. Neck turtles, some other stuff. 
a lot of the, the NECA stuff that's a little higher end and some blind bags. It's overall not really stuff I'm looking for. So I think this has been such a hit or miss Walmart, but I think I'm gonna call this one a bust for now. Well, at least I found one thing I'm looking for here today. All right, so uh, Walmart ended up being a bust. Um, even when I got to the grocery section, um, that Garden Mountain Dew was about the only thing I found that I was actually looking for. I had a few other things on my list, but surprisingly, they were out of like all of them. So a little odd, but it happened. So that's fine. I'm going to have to go to another Walmart anyway. I'll just try that later tonight. But uh, all right, I think I'm going to head a little closer to the house and hit up some of the ones that are closer to home. So let's keep going. All right, so this might actually be the worst of the targets I've looked at today. <sighs> it's okay. And it's sort of a thing that happens. You get like luck with one target and then you're out of luck. That's a whole lot of recondos. But yeah. Not really a lot of things I need, but I go over here. Ugh, I need NASCAR. Got a Kyle Bush, Chase Elliott. That's kind of a sad selection. Okay, well, wrestling is pretty stocked. I don't really see anything I need though, but <sighs> the same Nyla Rose figures that have been peg warming for a while. I have a feeling those Nia those uh, Nia Jaxes are gonna be peg warming a while too, so yeah, that was not very successful. <sighs> More turtle stuff though. Get some. Apparently now they have a Ninja Elite series. That's cool, but probably not something I'm gonna start collecting here. But yeah. Otherwise, nothing I'm particularly needing here. Alright, so continuing on into the evening, still got another couple of places to go, but I needed an energy drink. I haven't decided if I'm going to do this as like a separate video or if I'm just going to include this in this little mini vlog, but if not, we got a C4 energy drink. This one is the Cherry Starburst flavor, so I picked it up, I thought it was interesting. Make sure I don't crack the thing open everywhere. Oh, that smells incredible. Cherry Starburst are the best, so I'm um, gonna see what this tastes like. Oh. Okay, that's incredible, actually. Literally tastes like a liquefied Starburst. All right, I like that one. But yeah, this was pretty quick, so I'm just going to include it in the vlog there. So yeah, bonus review. C4. Uh, cherry Starburst flavor. It's great. Go try it. So apparently there's a Peeps flavored Pepsi. Why did they not call this Peepsy? Alright, so yeah, I didn't even bother filming some of the stuff there. Because it was just kind of pointless. It was basically the same stuff I'd been seeing before, so I didn't bother. I uh, went through and grabbed a few things, and of course, there's going to be an announcement over the loudspeaker, so we're just going to let that... Wow. But yeah, I'm just picking up a few groceries, and I think I'm going to call it a night, guys. So this has just been a day in my life, just a random day off running errands vlog, so... 
I think we'll call it here. Leave a comment, like the video, thumbs up, subscribe, all that great stuff. And uh, I'll see y'all next time.